So a couple years ago, I uh, like when I was living in Ithaca, for one summer I lived with a young girl. Her name was Sarah. And uh, we spent the summer in a house together. And uh, she was from Ireland. Well, she still is from Ireland, I guess. But um, she's from Ireland. And when she was in Ireland, she used to be a gymnast. And uh, one time uh, when she was practicing, she was, I think she was really good, apparently. I think she was pretty, really good. But anyway, somebody set the equipment up wrong and the equipment um, failed while she was in the middle of a routine. She hurt herself really badly, so she couldn't do gymnastics anymore. Um, so that's one piece of the story. But uh, another piece of the story, so we were living in this house and she would always come up. It was the first summer for her that uh, she did not go back to Ireland for a full year. She had not been in a year and she wasn't going back for that summer. And she would come into my room and she'd be like, Adam, uh, Man, it's so, it's so hard to be so far away from home and I, I really don't have any place to go if, I need, if I'm feeling lonely, if I feel like I need to go to a place to be safe, I don't feel like I have that because my home is across the ocean. And I thought that was interesting. So that's another piece of the story. And then the last piece of the story is that that summer I was infatuated with cartwheels. I would do, try to do, well try to do, I cannot do a cartwheel at all, but I would try to do cartwheels all the time. I would stop people in the street and I would ask them, can you do a cartwheel? Can you try to teach me how to do a cartwheel? Uh, and most people will try to teach you how to do a cartwheel if they can do it. They will do a cartwheel on any surface, concrete, grass, dirt, does not matter. They will break out a cartwheel if you request it, because I guess people are excited that they have that talent. I do not have that ability and uh, so anyway she was since she was a gymnast she was trying to teach me all summer we would spend like all afternoon for days at a time in the backyard trying to do cartwheels and those are the three pieces of the story that I think uh, wrote this song for me Back yourself, honey child, honey child Choke back those homesick tears Cause you're waking up alone And locking all the doors And turning into everything you fear Where you know you won't stop What you're searching for You don't know how long you're hurting for <laughs> Well, she smiles and she closes her eyes and she says It's just been so hard these days And just waking up alone to swallow all the gray And do it all over again Only you know you won't stop what you're searching for And you don't know how long you're hurting for You know you won't stop what you're searching for You don't know how long you're hurting for But you know she's a dreamer Yeah, but Sarah won't open her eyes Because she's dreaming of things Across the ocean, oh searching for and you don't know how long you're hurting for you know you won't stop what you're searching for you don't know how long you're hurting for and it never gets better and all the things she's better pulling her further down and she says life has a way of spinning you round a spinning you round, oh, and life has a way of spinning you round, a spinning you round. Oh, I could never be your cartwheel, cause I would never stick the landing. Oh, 
wish you know you won't stop what you're searching for and you don't know how long you're hurting for you know you won't stop what you're searching for you